as we have seen repeatedly, for some reason it's happening in a huge cluster this year, men are getting with these women who have like high profile lives, amazing, have a lot of good shit going on. And then once they get with them, they're expecting them to give all that up and center their lives around them. And when they don't, they have a huge problem with that. This is why the age old question, why don't these men just go for the pick me's who are ready made? They are willing to throw it all away for them. It is because of something that I have mentioned before. They wanna be able to say that they got a woman and pulled her down to their level and molded her into who they wanted her to be. They wanna be able to say that they destroyed somebody, they conquered someone, they took over someone. They like that control and feeling of power. All women are amazing. Don't come for me. Just hope you understand what I'm trying to say here. They want the, the cream of the crop, I guess. I don't know how to word this without, I hope I don't offend anyone. They want the woman who is at the top of her game great career might even be really attractive has a lot going on and they want that image attached to them because that is like an extension of themselves they want the notoriety they want the popularity they want the recognition they want her accomplishments to sort of rub off onto them and then when they feel like they own her they you know dust off their hands and say okay I loved that for you. I hope you had fun. Now I need you to shift your focus towards me. I once read a book uh, years ago talking about some random dating shit when I was back in my uh, dating era. And it basically explained the same thing that I'm trying to say here. Let's say a man likes hunting. He doesn't want a deer that is laid out on his front porch and has already been killed. Let's say this is the pick me. He wants to be able to go out, put up a fight, and then kill the most majestic deer so that he can go back to his boys and tell them the story about he conquered the legendary deer that's frolicking in the woods. So he kills it and then he takes it home and he puts it on his mantle to show off as his prize. Look at this amazing woman that I got. Look at all the awards and accolades and attention and all the good stuff she's got going on. Now she's mine. And I domesticated her. I destroyed her. I humbled her. I brought her down. This is why we as women have to be ready to leave at the drop of a hat because not all abuse is visible when, when y'all are dating in the courting phase. Sometimes when they have you locked, that's when they start to show their asses. That's why we got to have money saved. That's why we got to have a clear understanding of finances. And we always got to be thinking with our heads and all our hearts, our hearts all the time because our hearts are getting us screwed over. Be in love. I'm not saying that, you know, date if that's what you want to do, but always be ready to be left by your damn self. Because with these men that be minning at the rates that they be minning at, you just never know. Also, the worst thing you can do is say what your man would never do. My man would never cheat on me. My, my man would never leave me. My, ne my man would never lie to me. My man would never. Famous last words before a relationship is completely over because a man did what they thought they would never do. Every one of us is capable of doing horrible things. Just keep that, keep that in mind. We're all capable. There's a lawyer on this app who once said, always have a healthy level of distrust with people, okay? Your own friends, your own family would sell your soul for a corn chip for just the right deal. I don't care how much they love you. They might love you right now. I don't care how much they've been there for you when y'all have been through it and your man is so wonderful and he's just so, he's always been there and blah, 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 blah. People are people at the end of the day. Always look out for yourself. Always have yourself in a situation to where if you're alone and they leave you for whatever reason or you gotta end that relationship, you will be okay.